20 towns in 20 days, taking us to Weathersfield this afternoon. A beautiful day for this trip. That's where small businesses band together to keep customers coming back for more all the time. Channel 3's Caitlin Francis takes us right inside the old Weathersfield Country Store for today's Small Business Spotlight. This time of year feels extra magical walking along Main Street in Weathersfield, where you'll find the old Weathersfield Country Store decorated for the season. Step inside. We are probably mostly a gift store, but I would say most of our business comes from foot traffic. So once the weather is nice and people are walking around um, looking at the scarecrows on Main or for whatever reason, um, we get a lot more people in the store for sure. Natasha Franklin recently bought the store from her friend. Right when COVID started, I had gotten laid off from my previous job and she uh, was expecting a child. So it kind of worked out where I wanted to start my own business in wine and cheese. Um, and she was looking to get out of the risk of being a store owner. She says she's doing what she loves and things are going really well. She started selling charcuterie boards and cheese plates and she focuses a lot on supporting other small businesses. Like the candles are made here in Weathersfield. Um, a lot of the products we have are made in Connecticut. Um, and then we do try to be a fun store and like a lot of the businesses here in Old Weathersfield are each unique in our own way and that's pretty much what we highlight is the nostalgia, the, the local businesses. If you're getting in the Halloween spirit, the store is sprinkled with holiday items like these glasses and mugs made right here in Weathersfield. Or fans of a popular TV show set in Connecticut might recognize this one, Coffee at Luke's. Uh, a lot of the candles are seasonal. For the most part, the products stay the same. Um, the only change is going to be for the fall um, and Christmas, we're going to get a lot of um, that holiday stuff in and for the fall we have like the apple cider donuts from Roger's Orchard um, and apple cider and that sort of thing. Another popular item Franklin carries, these cocoa bombs also made by a woman in town and lots of other sweets. My favorite thing is probably the ice cream. So the ice cream is made um, at Grassroots in Granby. Um, and each, every couple of weeks, I pick up new flavors, and that's definitely brought a lot of customers in here. She whips up a butterbeer float, something she says kids and Harry Potter fans go crazy for, and something you can grab and go before you enjoy the scarecrows. In Weathersfield, I'm Caitlin Francis, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.